white girl gloop, 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 gloop. Let's go get a cup of joe. <laughs> that was one of the longest drives we've ever done in the RV. Ich war in Austauschschule für ein Jahr in Deutschland in 2008. Hi. What up? <laughs> Right now, we're three-fourths of the way through touring the U.S. in RV. And we know we really can't dilly-dally if we want to make it home before winter, because... Winter is coming. But for today, we're putting our strategic planning aside for some well-needed time in wine country. Thank you so much. The Finger Lakes. We make a scientific concoction. The Finger Lakes are all about the four W's. Wine, water, wilderness, and wine. If in the next four and a half minutes you will like what you see, then please subscribe and help us boost that beloved YouTube algorithm. Well, it's been a, a long drive today. Seven, what, seven plus hours, maybe even eight. We switched it to like the three-fourths mark. So Olivia drove most of it. But now we're just a mile away. It's really pretty. Very, very, very green. I, more green than I expected. Yeah. I feel like I've been saying that a lot on this road trip. I know. But it is. It's very country out here. A lot of RVs. I'm excited to see this campsite. I think it's on the water. I can't remember. Yeah, I'm get some food. I'm hungry. I just want to walk. My whole body is like. I like my a walk. Back a walk would be in. nice too. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> yeah buddy. Yeah. Yeah. That was one of the longest drives we've ever done in the RV and honestly, I don't think we're going to do that again. He does have a paper in his hand so that's good. Chomping on his gum like crazy. <laughs> we're both so tired. Yep, we've got the site number. I had to use the restroom. <laughs> oh, they had one open? Yeah, it's like a, there's like a pool table, ping pong table in there. Oh, cool. It's pretty nice. It has definitely like camping vibes here. Yeah. Very family oriented, lots of kids. Sorry, let me just get my bearings here. Good afternoon. We woke up this morning in the Finger Lakes, New York, and we have actually so far spent the last two days inside the trailer. Nathan, he's over there editing. Give us a little peace sign. What's up, bro? Nathan. Hi. What up? <laughs> we have three days here, but two of them are gonna be used for editing because we just got back on the road and we're, we're back to traveling again. There's just a lot of little things that we came back to that needed maintenance and we just totally didn't even think about. So even though we're in this beautiful place and we hoped to explore a lot more of it. We're gonna have just about a day. Crying baby in the back. Ignore that. But look also how funny this is. All of our hookups are on the opposite side of the trailer. So we've kind of just put them under. We've never had it like that before. <laughs> we really wanted the tree and the bench on this side. But also look, this is directly when we walk out and the tree <laughs> blocks the awning. So that, that was a huge win, wasn't it? All right, we are now in the Finger Lakes, New York State. It's our official day of actually exploring because the first two days we were here, we were on the computadora. No enjoy, no pleasure, just work. <laughs> to infinity. Um, oh my gosh, that's just beautiful. Wow. Yeah, well, There's a lot of homes on the water. Yeah, the Finger Lakes are really spread out. That's one thing we learned when we, we got here. There's many of them, first of all, and they're, they're probably take two to three hours to go from the farthest one west to the furthest one east. So you kind of have to know strategically where you want to situate yourself when you visit because it's going to take a lot of driving to go all over. Ready for the wineries. Basic white girl gloop, 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 shenanigans. Gloop, 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 gloop. Our campground is closest to Cayuga Lake, which is what we're driving around now. We just grabbed our Amity coffee. First stop, coffee, you know it. We just pulled up in front of Amity Coffee here in this cute little town, Penyan, and yeah, hopefully it's delicious. Motion. 
Stop. 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 And, uh, but we're gonna try and maybe do the, the Seneca Wine Trail. That's, Seneca is like a lake to the right of Cuca that's much larger and known for their wineries. So that's something we're hoping to do is maybe hit up, you know, one, maybe two wineries today, a little bit, you know, tipsy, feel good. Puppy. Puppy. Mm. Oh. Uh, so the first winery right now that we're trying to go to is called Three Brothers. And it's, we're gonna actually end up making the full loop of Seneca Lake. I thought we were only gonna do the west side, but it turns out there's a lot of really cool wineries on the east side as well. I'll show you guys a map of it because it's just, it's crazy how many wineries are here. not the cutest wallpaper you've ever seen. <laughs> and look, then you got this guy, very fancy. And then you got a toucan. Awesome. Enjoy, it goes right in order on the menu. Oh, perfect, thank, thank you. you so much. Yeah. Oh, Great. So thank excited. You. Okay, so let's see. So we have a sparkling, a white blend, a Riesling, a Riesling, and a Chamber, chin, chamborsin. What, how do you say that? Come on, French boy. How do you say that? Chamborsin. Chamborsin. Oh, there's just like the faintest sous-son of like uh, asparagus, and there's a. Just... So you're shaking every little last drop, dude. Yeah. Don't they say you're supposed to do it from your chin? Alright, you gotta try it now. <laughs> try it. It's a good one. That's nice. Pretty nice, pretty nice. It's a sweet, desserty. Mm -hmm. That's good, that's good. To the next. Hello, I'm Moira Rose, and if you like fruit wine as much as I do. So we just passed through this town called Geneva, and it, it's not the it's not the Geneva from Switzerland. It's the Geneva from New York State. And I mean, all I gotta say is it's a charming town. I mean, it's pretty intact from the the, the good old days. The architecture, the the little breweries, cafes, restaurants. Dog got me two spots. I just gave him a big hug and he just proceeded to drool all over me. Robert. It's all good. Puppy love. He's a cute dog though. You basically, he's the greeter as soon as you come in. He comes and says hi. There's like tennis balls around so you know. If you have one nearby, you gotta. Good vibes. Yeah. This is your 356, that's the bubbly dry. So the 356 will be hers. Hers, yeah. Oh, perfect. Right. He'll gladly drink it, won't he? <laughs> I, was, I was about to... He was okay with it. He was like, yeah. well, you know, I'll take it. <laughs> awesome. Thank you so much. All right, Nathan, start us off, boy. So a slightly different setup here. It's not the scientist, uh, what are those things called? The Little beakers or... The beakers What or... would you call that? No, that's, that's, no, a, that's, not that's a a champagne. I don't Dang. know. Whatever it's called. Anyways. Here they give you an ounce and a half, uh, which is nice and generous. Mm -hmm. And Olivia got we pretty much got the same thing except for like one or two. I'm gonna just go. I'm gonna get into it. Well, you didn't sniff it. <laughs> this is the uh, Gewurztraminer. Gewurztraminer. I think this area he mentioned they're known for Riesling primarily, 
dry Riesling because the weather's perfect for it. And the dazzling peach curl bat pull to his Riesling Rioja. And secondly, Gewürztraminer, which is another German name. Hey, Flotz, where are you going? Hello, ich heiße Nathan. Ich war ein Austauschschüler für ein Jahr in Deutschland in 2008. Da ich habe Deutsch gelernt. Ich habe uh, in einer Tennismannschaft gespielt. <lacht> Ich habe vier Bier getrunken, <lacht> auch. Not a fan of that one, let's be honest. Moving on to the next. How do you feel about the wine? First place was really good, second place was eh, eh but the second place had a better view, so it's kind of like. We were all about that life, honestly, with you. Yeah. But it was gorgeous. The first one had some really good wines, I felt like. Randy Cafe. So as we mentioned earlier, we're making our way west in hopes of avoiding any future freezes in some of these northern states. Yep, that's right. No more snowmageddons for no us. No freaking way. <laughs> Serious? Yeah. <laughs> Dear God. Hey, then. We made a quick stop in Ohio, and before we knew it, we were already in Michigan. <laughs>